Alright, yo. It is your boy. And today, I'm going to show you how to get steering wheel on GTA without having to add files to your server that make them vulnerable. Head over to Xbox 360 controller emulator. Boom. Download this. It's going to give you a zip file with an EXE. You drag that EXE into a folder that you have named. You can put it wherever you like. It doesn't really matter. Mine's just in here. You drag that in. I don't have to, but I might as well, just to show you. Drag it. Open it up. You can most likely have 5M open while you're doing this, and it should work. If you hear that, it it's working, but you're probably gonna get like a little setting that comes up saying blah, 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 blah. You hit your yeses and nexts, and then you'll be on this screen. And if you've gotta make sure that your thing is here. If you have any other controllers, devices mapped, they're gonna show up here. So look for the one that shows your steering wheel. If it's got no binds, hit auto map, let it do its thing. It might not bind the buttons properly, but just let it do it. And then it will have like the feeling of your steering wheel somehow. And then just head over to here, click on your right thumbstick, or not thumbstick, trigger, hit your gas, and now it automatically maps it to the full trigger. So full down is full trigger down, and then, you know, half is half. Go to this side, bind brake, perfect. Go to here, left or right doesn't matter, click it, turn your wheel, it's mapped. Now the whole thing left and right will be mapped. So when you go this way, it'll be full. Like when you full turn the steering wheel, it'll be full left. And when you full turn the steering wheel right, it'll be full right. Um, with the other binds, you can honestly add whatever you like. I've got my fourth gear in with my gears to go handbrake. So I can just go down, up, and get a little handbrake on. And then if I wanna walk forward without having to use my keyboard, I've got gear three to walk forward, as well as one of my buttons to hit the horn. And obviously, you know, the normal binds that come with, you know, your Xbox controller. Um, but yeah, you can pretty much change all those however you like, provided you've got those buttons on the wheel somewhere that, to change them to. And then you can head to here. You can screw with this if you like, this is how you, like, if you want to copy mine, it, always have that inverted, and it'll be pretty close to having a full steering wheel with a little bit of, um, like, assist to where you don't have to full turn the wheel to save your car. But if you want, you can go full 100% to have it, you know, fairly similar to what it would feel like driving an actual car, or you could make it lower so that you turn a tiny bit and it full locks the steering wheel up to you. Um, if you want force feedback, the only way right now is to hit enable, leave it on constant and turn this up or down however you like. But the only way that that's gonna actually give you feedback is when you hit gas. So when you're driving your car, gas, and then you'll start feeling the feedback, but it's not the feedback that you're used to from other games. It's it's more of a, just a force on the wheel that gives it a, a feel that you're driving the car, but it doesn't actually give you the feel like of where your wheels are and shit like that, you know, like it usually would. So it's up to you if you want to use that or not. There is another option to have that turned off, leave this off and then head to your steering wheel settings and turn your center spring on and turn it up and that'll make it feel a little bit better because that's pretty much the feedback that the game gives you. So having it, you know, through your thing will probably feel a lot better than having to press gas and feel it because it'll always switch through no strength and then having strength. You can pretty much have your 5M open the whole time while you're doing this and it most likely will find the, it'll pick up the controller while you're testing this and you'll be able to test, you know, whether the stuff works. And that's pretty much it. Enjoy and I hope to see you guys in city and we can have some fucking races with a steering wheel. Enjoy.